Hello everybody. Uh, this is a short video showing an improved version of the sandcasting demo that I did a few weeks back. I have tapered the top of the sprue uh, to reduce turbulence uh, that was seen in the last one and also add a smooth transition to the base of the sprue in the beginning of the runner. But only on the outside. The inside um, was actually somewhat accidentally left sharp. So. Interestingly, we'll see what effect that has. So let's watch the pour full speed and then slow-mo. So we can see here that the top of the sprue now has a lot less turbulence than before. That bevel was really helping. But the inside corner of the base of the sprue in the beginning of the run, which is still sharp, uh, is a source of turbulence. Um, Kind of like Martin uh, at Old Foundryman said it would be. So, Martin, you're totally right. Um, but uh, otherwise, uh, it goes through the system very smooth. Um, now, I used water here without soap, so uh, you're seeing uh, more surface tension than uh, with the original ones. So, I won't be using soap again with the water. I also have to apologize for the... Um, leakage in general, terrible look of this uh, particular demo. Um, I tried a different technique for uh, printing these up and uh, finishing them and putting them together. And uh, I'm going to go back to the original way because it this way looks terrible. <laughs> so. so this is a repeat of the demo, but using a one-to-one -one mixture of water and corn syrup. Uh, to try and more closely mimic the fluidity and the pouring characteristics of aluminum. This was suggested uh, by Andrew Martin. Um, and uh, it was interesting to try. Uh, it's definitely more viscous. Uh, you can see the way it flows. It actually has a little trouble filling the top of the sprue at the beginning. And, um, but it has less surface tension. Um, which is normally what you see with uh, molten aluminum. So I'm not sure if this is the right direction or if I should stick to pure water. Um, opinions are welcome. And uh, so what do you think? Um, anyway, uh, thank you for watching everybody. And uh, I'll be back with more of these. I'm going to uh, fix that um, internal, that internal uh, corner uh, at the base of the sprue and uh, try a couple other experimental things and uh, definitely come up with something a little prettier and uh, see what happens. Uh, thank you, and uh, until next time, take care.